In earlier videos we discussed about different green hydrogen production processes. In this video we are going to discuss about hydrogen refueling station and the related infrastructure. There are mainly two types of hydrogen refueling station, HRS, namely liquid hydrogen refueling station system and gaseous hydrogen refueling station system. Liquid hydrogen refueling station is always better than gaseous hydrogen refueling station due to expensive supply chain considering gaseous hydrogen refueling station at large scale and limited daily capacity. This is due to liquid hydrogen is much denser than gaseous hydrogen. For e.g. in order to store gaseous hydrogen more storage capacity is required than liquid hydrogen. Hydrogen refueling station system is classified as gaseous hydrogen refueling station. Gaseous hydrogen refueling station on site production facility liquid hydrogen fueling station. In gaseous hydrogen refueling station, as mentioned in block diagram above, gaseous hydrogen from the storage is available at 200 bars and then it is compressed up to 1000 bar using compressors. High buffers are provided to avoid steady supply of pressure without any fluctuations at dispenser end. Then due to heat of compressor the gases gets heated and is cooled in chillers at 40 degrees Celsius. This type of system is also known as H70. High pressure compressed hydrogen. The system is applicable for standard pressure compressed hydrogen, H35. Where the system is same but the gaseous is compressed at 350 bars. In gaseous hydrogen refueling station with on-site production, as mentioned in block diagram above, Gaseous hydrogen is available from electrolyzer plant at 30 bars and then it is compressed up to 900 bar using compressors in two stages. Buffers are provided to avoid steady supply of pressure without any fluctuations at dispenser end. Then due to heat of compressor the gases gets heated and is cooled in chillers at 40 degrees Celsius. In liquid hydrogen refueling station as mentioned in block diagram above, liquid hydrogen is available from liquid storage vessel stored in cryogenic conditions at 242 degrees Celsius and 10 bars and then it is pumped up to 900 bar using high pressure positive displacement pumps. Then the liquid hydrogen is then converted to gaseous hydrogen through vaporizer. Buffers are provided to avoid steady supply of pressure without any fluctuations at dispenser end. Then gas is cooled in chillers at 40 degrees Celsius. The type of hydrogen refueling station will depend on vehicle compatibility, station availability, vehicle performance, environmental impact, safety and regulations. Thanks for watching.